welcome Smite fans to your Combo Breaker Patch Notes Overview. Not only do we have a new god this patch, but major balance changes to items, actives, and even the gameplay. But first, we gotta talk about skins. We'll only get one tier 2 skin this patch, and it's from the Dragon King himself, Ao Kuang. Ao Kuang takes off his top, showing off his muscular armored chest, and ditches the deer antlers for more intimidating horns. The next skin we'll see is Iron Crow Hu Yi, which you'll earn for obtaining 7,000 fantasy points. Similar to Orbital Strike Rom, Hu Yi suits up in a more post-apocalyptic style and ditches the fireballs for a more heavy-hitting ultimate. Speaking of fantasy points, the 2015 SPL season ticket has been upgraded, offering more rewards for hitting certain FP goals, including two new announcer packs that you, the players, voted for. Moving on to gameplay changes. It's a lot, so get ready. The two major objectives, Gold Fury and the Fire Giant, now have a 50% reduction in lifesteal, making it more difficult for hunters and other non-guardians to tank them. Also, scaling has been added to the Gold Fury's EXP and Gold Rewards, making early game GF kills less destabilizing to the enemy team and encouraging trading towers for objectives. Moving on through the jungle, pretty much every buff camp in Smite is being altered in some way. The smaller Cyclops and Harpies are having their starting health reduced, as well as the starting physical damage. The bigger Harpies found at the mid and back camps will have reduced XP value, and finally the Cyclops buff holders will have lower starting health. But that's not it for the jungle. The mid Harpy camps will now be starting at 10 seconds once again instead of their previous 3 minutes. The blue and purple buffs will now respawn every 3 minutes instead of every 4, and the back harpy camps will also respawn 20 seconds faster. All these jungle changes come accompanied with the big changes to Hand of the Gods. Rank 1 Hand of the Gods now only hits a single target, that target always being the one with the highest health. Rank 2 hits 2 targets, and you guessed it, Rank 3 hits 3 targets. But it doesn't end there. Wrath of the Gods no longer deals a percentage of health to the objective bosses. Instead, it deals 480 true damage to jungle camps and 900 to objectives. Also, if your teammates use Wrath of the Gods on the same target within 10 seconds, the damage is halved. Moving on to our other actives, Greater Sprint no longer removes the in-hand movement speed penalty, and Heavenly Agility has reduced duration from 6 to 5 seconds. Wards have seen several changes in this patch as well, including a reduced vision for the basic ward. Players can now only place two wards at a time, and when a ward is placed, it will be visible to enemies for one second. Lastly, landing the killing blow on an enemy ward now rewards you 50 gold. Chin size are back with a reduced cost of 2850 gold. Shoes of the Magi had a reduction in its power, but replaces it with 10 magical penetration. Magi's Blessing gets nerfed with an increase in price and an increased cooldown from 60 to 90 seconds. Heartseeker and Doom Orb see similar changes this patch. Instead of a high number of stacks, these items now only have a max of 10 stacks, but each stack now offers you more power. God Kills now grant two stacks, and still half of your stacks are lost on death. Now on to God Balance. Bastet's Cats will have a lowered health to reflect the changes to Hand of the Gods. And that's actually it for God changes. Finally, we can move on to Ravana, the Demon King of Lanka. Ravana is joining Smite as a physical melee warrior. His moves reflect something you'd see from a fighting game, relying on his fists and feet to take down his foes. His kit has slows, roots, and even a self-heal, but my favorite move is his overhead kick, which renders him immune to damage during the duration, allowing for epic evades from devastating enemy ultimates. That is all I have for you this week, everyone. If you want to read the full Combo Breaker patch notes, just go to our forums at forums.smitegame.com.